Hey, what's going on YouTube? I device helper, and today in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to jailbreak the new iOS 6.1.1 on the iPhone 4S. Now, the evasion uh, application to jailbreak the iPhones has been updated to support 6.1.1 on the iPhone 4S, which is the latest version for the iPhone 4S as in the filming of this video. Now, a quick note to all the people that rely on an unlock. If you're unlocked on 6.0, 6.0.1, or 6.1 do not update I will have an update video uh, once the unlock is confirmed to be working as of right now do not update yet uh, I'll have again my official video once the unlock is confirmed for everybody else that bought a new device on 6.1.1 or decide to update to 6.1.1 this video is for you so the first thing you must do is uh, do not update over the air connect your uh, device your iPhone 4s to your computer uh, via USB and make sure that you back up your device is real simple you gotta click right click here on the column section of iTunes right there's the backup button go ahead and back up again you can just right click it you can just right click it right there and back it up now uh, another quick note here for you guys is if you have a passcode lock here on your lock screen before getting into your device you must remove that as well so uh, okay those are some of the things you must do before you begin so if you don't do the restore with the computer or if you don't remove the passcode lock this will not work for you okay so once you do that you're set and ready to go you update it through iTunes the evasion application which I'll have in the video description down below right here it is on my desktop all you gotta do is simply launch it and it's really really simple all you have to do is click these jailbreak button that lights up here and it'll do its job it's really really simple Again, the application will be in the video description down below, so make sure you read it so you can go ahead and download the new version. Now, this jailbreak does take about five minutes. You don't have to touch your device at any point. Uh, the application will do everything on its own, so I'm going to kind of fast forward through some of the steps to make the video uh, shorter, of course. All right, so there's the first boot up. Alright, so the jailbreaking process has officially begun at this point. Again, do not touch your device at any time until the application tells you to. So you can see the blue progress bar moving along here, letting us know the progress of the jailbreak at this point. Uploading Cydia packages at this point. Alright, now when this flashes, it says to continue, uh, go ahead and pa uh, slide to unlock. It's telling us that's what it says there. You want to slide to unlock you'll have a new application on your springboard just tap it once it'll quit on its own that's all you have to do that's the only time you have to touch your device alright so now we're booting up again and there we have the jailbreak logo starting up city of packages at this point it's rebooting again Again, this whole process takes about five minutes. So if you have, guys have any questions at all and you're new to the jailbreak, uh, make sure you follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. Plus. All the links will be down below, including the link to download the Evasion Jailbreak. This is version 1.3 as of the filming of this video. Again, for the iPhone 4S, supports iOS 6.1.1. And again, uh, I cannot stress this enough for all people that rely on an unlock if you're unlocked in iOS 6.0 6.0.1 or 6.1 do not update you will lose your unlock wait for my official unlock video let's go ahead and slide to unlock and we should have Cydia there it is so once we launch Cydia it should start preparing packages here it's gonna close on its own once it's done and again by the way this is an untethered jailbreak by the way Alright, so City is done loading up. Now we can slide to unlock and we're officially jailbroken in iOS 6.1. Select your usability and City should load up. If there's any updates, make sure you do the updates in City first before you begin downloading any packages. Go ahead and confirm that we are in iOS 6.1.1 here on this iPhone 4S. There it is, 6.1.1. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, if this video helped you, Please thumbs up, guys. I really do appreciate it when you thumbs up my video. It helps me out a ton. Uh, and make sure you stay up to date with the latest information on your iOS device, of course, by going to iDeviceHelpUs.blogspot.com. It's been iDevice. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will catch you guys on the next one.
Peace.